Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Destiny Mata. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is February 27th, 2023. Now let's take a nice brain break. Put your hands on your belly. Imagine you have a balloon in there. And when you breathe in, you're filling the balloon up with air and making your belly blow up. Breathe out and let the air out of the balloon. Your belly should go in and your hands go down. Let's repeat that. Breathe in through your nose. Fill the balloon up with air. Now breathe out of your mouth. Let the air out of the balloon. What a great way to start the week. Now let's take a look at our Black History Spotlight with Nia. Destiny, good morning, Patriots. Today we are spotlighting Nigerian computer scientist Philip Amiglawe. He is known as the Bill Gates of Africa for his invention known as the Connection Machine. What this does is that it links 65,000 computers linked in unison. That makes the fastest computer in the world. Together, they can act 3.1 billion calculations per second. This is still used to this day to help predict the likelihood and effects of global warming. Now let's go check in with Hadassah for today's tasty lunch. Thank you, Nia. Today's lunch is barbecue cheddar burger, sandwich, mustard, baby carrots, fresh broccoli, ranch dressing, diced peaches, pane alfredo, breadstick, and your choice of milk. And tomorrow's breakfast is French toast sticks, syrup cup, graham crackers, fresh orange, 100% apple juice, fruit loops, and your choice of milk. Students, keep in mind lunch can change at any time. And to always bring your lunch card. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, now let's go back to Destiny. Thank you, Hadassah. I can't wait for lunch. Scholars, let's keep completing those lessons for this quarter's instructional software challenge. Take a look at the flyer to see the requirements and make sure to have them done by March 26th. Scholars, our Black History Month calendar ends tomorrow, so record your class dancing in a soul train line for the last day. Please don't forget our cell phone policies. It is important to make sure you have your phone shut down and your backpacks at all times. And also, don't forget you are not allowed to chew gum in school. Make sure to spit it out before you enter the building. Sports fans, tomorrow our boys basketball teams have a game against the Browser Marmonades at Davy Powell. The junior varsity game will be at 1 p.m. and the varsity game will be at 2 p.m. This is the last game of the season, so good luck, boys, and let's go, Patriots. Patriots Boys Baseball second tryouts will be this Wednesday, March 1st. Make sure to bring your sports packet and physical. If you went to the first tryouts, you do not have to attend. Good luck, Patriots. The next family night is coming up soon. It will be on March 15th from 6 to 8 p.m. It's going to be at Off the Wall, so prepare to have fun and check out the flyer for some more details. The Patriot store is open every morning. Tomorrow is the 3rd and 4th graders' turn to shop. Make sure to look at the schedule to see when it's your time to shop and bring your tickets. Now let's see what the weather looks like today with Jaiseline. Thanks, Destiny. Hey, Patriots. Today's weather will be a nice 87 degrees for high with mostly sunny skies. Get outside and enjoy some fresh South Florida air. Now let's go to Hendrick for birthdays. Thanks, Jace Lee. Today's birthday boys and girls are Sabian McLeod, Nevea Janvier, Alexandra Prieto, Joshua Russell, Mary Antonia Tavares, and Avalyn Taylor. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Destiny. Thank you, Hendrick. Patriots, hear your pet's expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Carter, Ms. Manning, and Ms. Stone. You all had the correct answer to Friday's daily challenge, which was, who put the glue on the teacher's coffee mug? The correct answer was Zara. And now for today's daily challenge. Daily challenge. What color is a hippo sweat?
Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answer to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a marvelous Monday. And remember, here at Pines, we are going to be new excellence in education. Have a great day.